Welcome back to the Return to Raven Creek series. I'm Fire Nation, and this is Bessie Foss's story. Thank you for joining me, and welcome back to another fantastic adventure with our gal, Bessie Foss. She is getting hungry, so let's rectify that real quick and eat some chips. Mmm, <laughs> yes, chips. The, the food of the gods. Let's put this sink away. We're not ready for it yet. Whoop. Put you guys away we need to go grab that trash can and i need to clean up some of these twigs before it gets out of control we need to get some more wood um we also need some more decorations for our base and i'm just gonna keep stealing from this place because nobody's doing anything about it so fair game right bam yeah we need some more wood um do i want to take this tile yet now nah, we'll come back for it whoa okay I just popped into the shower for a quickie. And rip. Also, I need to make a driveway in here. And I saw an interesting comment. Well, I was seeing a man about a horse that you can pour out gravel to make a path for your vehicle. I don't think I ever knew that. So thank you. Uh, Uthred, I actually remember your name this time. <laughs> so many people post helpful comments and I always forget to... Give him a shout out. I'm terrible, I know. Let's place this wheelie bin right here. Bam. We even got our own garbage can. I'm gonna get a mailbox for this place too. You think I won't? I'll do it. I'll do it. I'm crazy enough. I'm gonna have a mailbox. Zombies will deliver me mail. Uh, twigs. Bam. I just want to get rid of all this crap before I forget and not, like don't do it later and then I put off doing it because it's a huge chore we don't have to get all of them right now just some there we go that should be good enough also we could do some foraging around here too. grab those two I bet we find some decent stuff delete all and yes and somebody was telling me let me see no not that um investigate this area if you hover over the eyeball Weather effect, minus 10.79%. Gives you a search radius. Folding effect, minus 2.5. Okay. I'll move around. Yeah, I've already found those. Thanks. So I didn't know that. And then if you hover over here, you can see what your uh, possibilities are. As far as foraging goes. So the weather... And I bet the time of day and your gear play a factor into the foraging. That's awesome, and I never knew that. Might as well grab these twigs. They're all right here. Okay. But that's enough of that. We'll do that another time. Do I have... I do have... We need one more skill in foraging, and then we can read the Foraging 5 book. Awesome. And I do believe all these tree branches I'm going to keep... And turn into spears. That way I can not litter everywhere. And also at the same time burn up the 5 million short blade weapons I have. Because <laughs> I've got a ridiculous amount. Um, just the tree branches please. There we go. I like how they're all kind of grouped up roughly. There we go. All of you. And I see you. I see you there. Yep, you're mine now. I want to start running spears. Get those leveled up. Um, so we'll toss these in here. Our lovely Humvee with the 130 storage. It could be more, but I beat the crap out of it. <laughs> I'm sorry. What do you say to a Humvee with two black eyes? Nothing. It's already been told twice. <laughs> uh, I don't have my wood axe. That's a bad joke. I'm sorry. Let's get in here, grab our wood axe and our ropes, and get ourselves some more wood. Bam. And we probably only need half of these for now. I still got a tree branch on me. We'll put it in the box. Bam. Okay. Um, there was something else, too. There was something else. Eleven. Dang it. Oh, well. What am I? Oh, water. Yeah, we need to stop by here and get some water. 
Thankfully, there's plenty of sinks up in here. And our rain collector barrel will be filling up. Boom. Just like that. Straight out of the bowl. Like an ant eater. <laughs> water. Bowl water. My favorite. Yes. Cut down the trees. Yes. couple more days of chopping and we'll need to repair this axe for the first time has a potential of 75 whopping percent 75 wing wings of condition repair so we're waiting oh my god i thought i heard something i thought i heard the rustle of a bambino behind me that scared the crap out of me there we go take these two logs but no, it was just the wind jiggling the trees. That's eight right there. Perfect. One, two. Aw, oh, man. It always happens this way, too. I always end up with two extra. Or one extra. Four lots stack. Bada bing. Go down here. We can barely walk. Can I get eight? Yes. Bada boom. And... Uh, no, I'll come back for those. Four logs stack. We're out of ropes. That's fine. Let's grab what we can. Oh my god. Yeah, she can barely move. You and you should be good strength and fitness training right in the mirror. And you. I, was, I, I actually can't remember if she started out with max strength or not. It's possible we lost this much strength, but I don't think so. I think she started out with 11, or a uh, 9 strength and not 10. I can't remember. I'd have to go back to her first video. Okay, let's get these in here. I, I do need to start exercising. And I've got the uh, dumbbells and the fitness contraption and the weight benches. So I can utilize those to, I think, make better progress. Make better gains gains oh yeah it's all about the gains let's grab one more of these so that we have an even number bada boom and i should move my chair in here now because it'll be safer to rest and speed up time and we'll place you like right by the door bam easy as i don't like this this water line here but we'll have to put up with it Actually, I think I am going to put a wall right here, too. It's got a floor above it. I'm just going to close it off so it's not an eyesore. Let's get some rest. We'll get back out there and take down some more trees. Because we're a survivalist woman. She's awesome. Rugged. And one hell of a survivor. I wouldn't want to be on the receiving end of her machete swing. Tell you that much. No, I'm going to leave those there. Orlock stack. She's probably got some forearms that are tree stumps by now. Nine months of swinging machetes, axes, pipes, wrenches, all kinds of stuff. She's got some bricks for arms now. All right. And I'm going to take down this grove of trees as well. Make getting in and out of here easier. And you. Oh, oh, oh. What was that? Sometimes it kind of glitches out and she won't move to the tree and chop it. Namely, when you're pressing the keys way too fast. There we go. And can I get four? Can I get these four? Come on. Come on. Oh, man. Come on. Why you gotta do me like that? Four log stack. Boom. Two four log stacks. Bam. Bam. Okay, let's grab these. And you. And one in the inventory. And then we'll come back over here, grab you. Oh, oh, yeah, if you're doing any major construction projects, invest in the ropes. Grab them when you see them. They weigh less than sheet ropes. And... You can carry way more four log stacks than you can just regular logs. It is a lifesaver. Okay, put these on the ground. That should be enough building material for now. We'll get the log machine going. 
get it primed and then we'll pull start <laughs> Machine. <laughs> okay. Ah, oh, God. Um, put our ropes up. <laughs> Do you like my pull start jalopy sounds? How are we missing one rope? Didn't we have twenty one? Oh no, never mind. Uh, nine thirty p.m. We do need to sleep. Let's rest real quick. All right, yeah, we'll go to bed. Do I have any more food on me? We're gonna have to make a pit stop back home. Let's open up another box of nails. One. Might need to grab some more nails, too. Dang, we're burning through them. Got a roof on here now. Oh, yes. I like it. Yeah, if you crouch, you can get the sleep icon to come up. That way you don't have to continuously lay in the bed if you're like me and you get sick of the right click abuse this mouse has lasted a long time <laughs> i love it the g402 hero 502 hero from logitech but logitech's sometimes a hit or miss i've had this same brand and and make and it died like a month after i got it click started going out not that let's go back home and get some food I feel like all electronics are like that too. I've had skull candies that am I not in the front? I've had skull candy earbuds that lasted like two weeks and they were dead. I've also had a pair of skull candy earbuds that went through the washer twice. Um, I took them to work all the time. I had them for like two or three years and they still work. They're over in my jewelry cabinet. They still work. Been through the washer and dryer like three times. Just always a hit or miss with electronics. Especially if you get stuff off Amazon. Okay. Bam. Whenever I'm buying like headsets or earbuds or anything, I generally go to a store though. There we go. Just so I... Because returning things to Amazon is the biggest hassle in the world. Oh my god. Um, game and vegetable, game and cabbage. Whoa, what's this one? 92, 96. We'll grab this one. Also, we need to go check on our traps. It's been a few days, so let's favorite this. And how's our weight doing? 79. Good. We'll grab something light. Um, we have any canned fruit? Of course we do one two just to keep us from going uh into the hunger stages when it starts messing with your fighting capabilities and we'll grab do we not have any more carrots surely we have more carrots i know we did yeah right there we got 98 uh those ones are almost burnt let's just grab half and that's good Awesome. I do need to replant my carrots back upstairs. Apparently they're better for catching rabbits. I don't know. I think they have more probability of catching rabbits. Since I've been using carrots over the months, I've never caught a bird in my trap. It's always been rabbits. But when I used to use cabbage and other things, I would always catch just either birds, sometimes rabbits. Oh, they broke one of the traps. Dang you. Check trap. At least you get the wire back. Check trap. Alright, what did we get? 3.57. He's a big boy. 2.09. Hell yeah. Nice. Add bait. Also, frozen cap uh, carrots work just fine. I figured out. And we'll add bait to this one. Take our wire back. Do we have any other traps out here? I don't think we do. No. And what did it take? Make the... Oh, we can craft one right now. Yeah. We just need five units of wire. Is 
that mean every time it breaks you can just remake it? We'll have to see how much we get on the next one that breaks. Put you back down. Add some bait. Alright. More set up. Let's also grab this scrap wood from our old traps. Oh, a couple nails. Yeah. And, ooh, a couple more nails. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. All right, that's it. Because there's a garbage can right near. I thought that was a zombie down there. Oh, my God. Um, Proximity loot got us again. Turn you off. Scroll down. Delete. Awesome. Awesome Blossom, Senior Opossum. Let's go back home. Get these butchered up. Also, let's grab some uh, some knives to bring down to the fishing lodge for butchering and creating spears. I've got a ton of them. Let's actually butcher these real quick. Bam and bam. When you butcher them, it reduces the weight by a little bit so it helps for storage and we'll put you guys uh right there yeah awesome put our carrots back in there i think this year i'm not gonna uh, grow like a stupid amount of vegetables i need to put you guys in there and freeze you same goes for all this yeah i'm not gonna grow a stupid amount of vegetables and then have to power like six fridges again. That got ridiculous. Also, did I unplug this stuff down here? Yes. Yes. Oh, all my little friends. How we doing? I've missed you. And the icy cooler is unplugged. Yep. Okay. Let's top off on some water. I always forget we have a working sink here now, too. And we are going to get to more constructing and decorating on this base, too, as well. Oh, and I already started moving some food in here. Nice. Thank you, past me. Gentleman and a scholar. Okay. Let's roll. I so want one of these on the, on the deck. Hell yeah. Looking out towards the forest. On our, our fishing cottage. Oh, we still have carrots. Yeah, we'll eat them. Some snacks for the way. There we go. Open the door. I love this game. I'm so glad I started doing batch recording. Because I gotta tell you, playing this game and recording and making videos every single day, it gets old quick and the burnout becomes real. Definitely the way to go. Do it in spurts. By the time I get done recording... I'm like, man, I don't want to play Project Zomboid anymore. I'm, I'm done. I just want to go to bed. But then, like, the week goes by and I don't touch the game. And this is, like, my, I think, favorite game. It's definitely my most played now. Um, but yeah, when the weekend comes for me, which is the weekdays, I'm like, hell yeah. Let's get down. From Project Zomboid. Ooh. Give me that. Take this in here. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. Put you down. Unstack. Process these bad boys up. Oh. So I did have more ropes. I tried to do the uh, log sawing machine, but it didn't really work. Okay. And I'll show you guys what I was talking about. Unpack this. I want one of these bad boys. Maybe even two. Like that. Hell yeah. I kind of want to try the horde mode mod out. Oh, I forgot the compost bags. Oh, well, we don't need that yet. Yeah, I kind of want to try the, the uh, horde mode mod. I think that could be fun. Also, I forgot to bring knives. Trying to build and design a base that'll withstand the zombies. But I think if I'm going to do that, I have to get something to even it out a little bit like uh there's mods that let you build traps like spike pits and stuff or so i've heard i haven't searched for them myself but somebody was talking about a tiger trap in the comments one time and i am about it okay let's do some building yeah 
We got all those logs. Let's get the walls put on this piece. Put our axe away. It's almost ready for repairs. Go to the floor. 167 wing wings. I love it. Equipped our hammer. Oh no, where did we put our hammer? Did I move it back into my bag? I did. Felt right. Equipped our hammer. There we go. And fill up the rest of the way. And before I forget, wall, wall frame, right here. Where she was trying to go. Oh my god, those seagulls. Shut your mouth or your beak. Um, I need to take a look from the outside real quick. Okay. Right here. I think I need to extend everything one more tile out. Yeah. Fair enough. We'll do that. Carpentry wooden floor. From here. Yeah, they won't be able to get through there. I'll put a wall up anyways. And you. From there. It'll give us a little bit more room. And we'll have a safety tile. In fact, what I'm going to do is... When I get the walls in, I'm going to go around the outside. Like right here. And just put a safety tile. And then I'm going to disassemble whatever floors I use to get to this area. That way we have the safety tile outside. And if I fall off and land on the tile, I can just take out a wall or whatever. Can I disassemble these walls? I can, right? Yeah. Perfect. Yeah, I can just take a wall out. Get back into the base. Alright. Let's get these doors up. Or not doors. <laughs> walls. Wooden wall frame. Bam. And rotate. Nope, not there. Nope, not there. Stop it. Oh, I'm gonna have to do that anyways. So that I can build the walls. Because you can only do them from the outside on this side. Fair enough. So I'm gonna need it either way. But we can get the wall frames up for now. 125 more. Love it. Love it. Carpentry, wall, wooden wall frame. I might also put some support pillars in here just for looks too. I kind of like how the stairs look like they're uh, supporting the building in a way. Alright. One more grab. And we'll have all the stuff. Oh, wait. Do I st oh, no. It's because I ran into the pile. Yeah, now we have enough to put in all the frames. Awesome blossom. Sweet and sour opossum. We're doing it. We're living off the lay. Hell, I could move all my stuff over here and... Ah, uh, no. I've already built so much on the main base. Those... Glitchy wall areas where I tore down the other houses. They're just such an eyesore. <laughs> I hate them. I really do. I'm never gonna do that again. Okay. Uh, not there. Right here. We might have enough to get all the walls done. And the floor on that side. Maybe. And you, and you. By the way, this isn't a mod for, like, instant construction. I'm just pressing the keys so fast, it looks like that. You speed up by one times to go to the wall. And then you speed up by the, the two times, or whatever. The second fastest speed to build. So I have my keys rebound to F1 and F2. Uh, let's see, carpentry floor. So, for instance, F1. I can't build there yet. F1, F2. F... Whoop. Can I not build there? F1, F2. So she'll move to the location, start the task, and then when she starts the task, you can speed it up even faster. Like that. Perfect. Now we need more wood. Hop on in. And then off the 
Oh, did I... Off the back of this. I forgot the whole purpose of this place. That's okay, I'll take one of the walls out. Off the back of this, we're gonna make like a dock. For fishing. And we'll probably put like a roof over it. So we can keep out of the rain. Wooden wall, level three. Yeah, I totally forgot to leave a, a space for a door frame. And you. Ah, oh, one plank shy. Come here. Oh, wait, what? Oh, no, we're nails. Well, we need nails. Let's just open both of these. There we go. Unpack you. All right. Wooden wall level three. Bam. And now it is complete. Okay. Let's disassemble gonna need to be these three so delete I have no idea if I'll be able to grab the materials from this just turned it into dirt what okay I'm gonna leave the floor there and um, dang it. That means I'm gonna have to wall this off now. You know what? That's fine. We'll make this into a little generator room. Yeah. We'll move our generator over here and wall it off so it makes less noise. So, in that case, uh, carpentry wall. Put the door right there. New wall. And wall. Let's go get some more planks. I think I figured that out on the last Return to Raven Creek run. If you build over the water and then tear it up, it turns into dirt. I had just forgotten. Okay, carpentry, door, door frame. Bam. Okay. And let's build these walls in. Level three. Level three. Oh man, is it going to look weird without that? That's okay. We'll do this. We'll do this. There we go. That's fine. Oh, oh no, no. I have to build from the outside. Are you kidding me? You're kidding me. Please be able to reach it. No. No. Can, I can reach it to disassemble. Oh, man. I have a solution. I think if it'll work. Uh, that'll work. Yeah. Why not? Now at least it's closed off. And we'll pretend that that vents the carbon dioxide out from the engine. And take. I still need to get a roof on there. Uh, we'll put the generator like right here. Connect. Perfect. I guess the noise will still generate out from that, but whatever. There's no zombies around here, anyways, I don't think. Bessie already destroyed them all. <laughs> and we should be able to build. Oh, we still need floors over here. Uh, can we build right here? No. We're going to have to disassemble the fence. Oh, what's going on? Hello? Do I have to be on the outside to get it? <laughs> Seriously? And I build the floor from here. I think you can only do it from windows. Dang it, man. Urgh. <laughs> Not well thought out. All right. Well, when in doubt, 
grab the sledgehammer. Come here. Actually, no. Just equipped in both hands. There we go. Get her a cigarette. Because I know she's getting frustrated. Want this floor done. You. You're out of here. Sorry to say. I don't get the supplies back from you, but that's all right. Yeah, because we have to wall this off in order for our sink to work anyways. And there. Okay, perfect. That does go out over the water. Uh. Well, I'm going to extend the fence out to here. Yeah, that'll look fine. Okay. Uh, sledgy boy, you can go in here for now. Still doing good on nails. Let's put our saw away so that we can grab more planks. Wow, we're already down to 13 planks? No way. Damn, I guess so, yeah. We built all those walls and burned through them. All right, fair enough. Um, wooden floor... Finish this off. Okay. Yeah, and our fence will go, like, from here around. Oh, please have enough. Uh, yes! Awesome. We don't have enough for the fence yet, but that's okay. Got our generator room. We just need a door on there. We'll have to get some more planks for that. Oops. Drop you off. Okay. Job well done, I say. And we'll put these over here. The other thing I wanted to do... Let's, let's move, like, the oven over here. And see how it looks. We could put it on this wall. And then just have the sink on this wall. Yeah, that'll work fine. Why not? And then we'll have our door leading out to the dock in the middle here. Yeah, I like that. Pick up this fridge. We'll place the fridge right there. It'll be closest to the door. Pick you up. What did I pick up? Nope, not disassembled. No, 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 I said. Put that saw away. Just pick it up sink I think that's directly under the rain barrel I don't think it matters but I'm gonna put it here just in case and then we'll put a corner countertop right there okay well, let's grab our sink and our pipe wrench put you primary put you in the main inventory and we'll just see if we can plumb it here you there we should be able to. No? Are we missing some floor tiles? Oh, maybe over here we're missing some floor tiles. Hold on. Ah, it's hard to see in the dark. Like pitch black. Let's go to bed real quick. There we are. And we'll have some canned fruit cocktail. Eat you down real quick. We already smoked a cigarette crouch so that we can sleep right away. And fire needs some caffeine. Oh. Long days of building and decorating. I love them. Okay. So either the sink's in the incorrect spot. Or we're missing some roof tiles. I think we're missing some roof tiles. Over here. Why does that wall... Why does it... I didn't build a wall there. Why is this wall here? There shouldn't be a wall on the second level. Oops. Okay. I don't know what's going on, but I think I know how to fix it. 
put you away uh, grab our wood axe put that on our back screwdriver can go away keep that on us that's fine grab half plus one well perfect okay let's take down this grove of trees real quick be a little bit longer of a video but that's all right okay warlock stacks bam bam grab you guys and now we got one extra log right there to match with our three that we didn't have the mates for perfect okay and these two trees look prime you and you four log stack bam give me that okay get back inside i'm gonna have to build some stairs to get up there and then take them down unstack unless i blow a wall out up there i could do that uh no saw the logs There we go. And we'll get a little rest in real quick. Drop that exertion off. Perfect. Oh, somebody's getting eaten. Um, if I blow this fence out right here, I should be able to reach it. Yeah, there's no floor there. That's why. Uh, wait, what? Oh, I don't have my nail. Oh, I put them away. Right, right. Okay, while we're here, um, put you in there and our ropes in there, and then grab some more planks. Oh, go there. Oh, in main inventory. There we go. We already got our hammer equipped. Perfect. Okay. Carpentry. Oh, oh my God. Nails! <laughs> How many times do I have to say it, fire? Nails! Carpentry, wooden floor, bada bing. Now we can grab this into our backpack. No, main inventory. There we go. Okay. Floor. Oh yeah, we're missing a few out here. <laughs> a few. We'll have to extend our fence out on this side as well. That's okay. And I think our safety barrier as well. Perfect. And I definitely think we have enough planks on us. Okay. That should be... Oh, I wonder if it's because of the stair threshold, too. We still have our pipe wrench. We're going to have to make this its own room, aren't we? Dang it. Unless I build a door at the stop, top of the stairs, stop with the tears. Dang it. Dang it, Bobby. Yeah, because that's still qualifying as outside. I'm pretty sure that's the reason. Yeah, so either we close off the top of the stairs or we make a little room inside of here. This has a wall, right? Yeah, it just looks weird. Yeah, we could close this off like right here and then move the fridge. That might be easier. Okay. Oh boy, not that. Stop. Carpentry wall, wall, wall frame, walla walla frame. Actually, we could probably keep that there. Let me see, where's the edge here? Yeah, we could just go across from right there. We'll see. The fridge might still be in the way. All right. Uh, carpentry wall, wall frame. And then it'll look nice in here. Oh, oh. <laughs> that was weird. Yeah, we're gonna have to move it. There we go. Now this qualifies as a room. You could see it change. 
still too heavy. Wooden wall. Okay, now can we grab you? Yeah. Might be able to plumb the sink now. Yep, perfect. You don't even have to fill the walls in. That's lovely stuff. Also, that's good because I forgot again to put a damn door frame right here. All right. Well, this is now plumbed and functional. Look at that. Awesome. Anyways, be going on long enough. If you find yourself enjoying the content, leave a like and consider subscribing. You are one click away from joining the Fire Nation Army. And together, we will rule the apocalypse of Knox County, one fishing lodge at a time. And if you're just tuning into this episode, go on back to the Return to Raven Creek series start. It's been a doozy. Right now, it's Bessie Foss's time to shine, her time in the spotlight currently at 9 months, 21 days, 12 hours. We officially have a sink in our fishing lodge fridge and a functional oven when I turn the generator on uh, 15,765 Bambinos dispatch on Fire Nation. I will catch you guys in the next one. Have a great day out there, all you beautiful people.